Hey, how's it going, guys? Mr. Boss for the win here. And in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video, I'm going to be talking to you guys about some images of some exclusive vehicles that us 360 and PS3 guys are going to get on the Xbox One and the PS4. Now, I'm sorry if there's a little bit less content over the next, like, day and a half. I've kind of got my hands full with, let's just say, another version of GTA 5. But I'll talk about that in a separate video. Today, I'm going to be talking about all the different cars that were announced kind of last night on the Rockstar Social Club. They look absolutely epic, and I know you guys want to see them so let's get started so our first car is epic and this is the bravado buffalo s with kind of like a sprunk livery overlay on it now this looks great you can obviously see it follows the green white and yellow sprunk theme with a little bit of red mixed in there you can see that on the mirrors with the green wheels and that is absolutely epic rockstar said they were going to be doing this with a few muscle cars and i guess some sports cars as well considering the buffalo is a sports car but nevertheless that looks absolutely epic what a great looking vehicle that is right there our second one is a returning car from GTA 4, and this is the Dinka Ballista Compact. Now, there's already a Dinka Ballista in GTA 5, but it is not this compact version. It doesn't have the sunroof going on and doesn't have the older style look. So that is absolutely wonderful. That's going to be coming back into GTA 5. Up next is the Imponte Duke of Death. Now, that looks absolutely great. This is based off in a version of the Imponte Dukes, which is another car in the game, which we'll talk about in a little bit. And you can see the entire, like, epicness of this car. The body armor it's got, the lights on the roof, you know, all the brush guards and whatnot. It looks absolutely epic. That is a dangerous-looking vehicle. And following after that is the regular Imponte Dukes. So you can kind of see where the style is coming from right there. And you can see how those differ and how those really vary. Still, the Imponte Dukes, definitely a great looking car. I actually got my hands on that in GTA 5 on the next generation already. And I'm telling you guys, you are going to love that vehicle. Under that, we have a convertible version of the Stallion, another car returning from GTA 4. So this is going to be epic as well. This, of course, the soft top or convertible version and just a great looking classic vehicle. So up next, we have the GoGo -Go Space Monkey Ballista Compact. And this is a rare or kind of unique version of this car. You can see it's got the GoGo -Go Space Monkey text on the hood of the car. Kind of like a yellow and orange theme towards the end of the car. And it's got these like monkey decals on the side. So that is super epic. These next three cars really show off the great livery that we're going to be able to put on our vehicles. The first one is the Bravado Gauntlet, and this has the Redwood livery. Under that, we have the Vapid Dominator with the Pizwazer beer livery on there so that looks pretty epic as well and finally we have a burger shot yellow stallion this looks absolutely crazy one of the best looking liveries i think in the game you just have that nice meaty hamburger on the hood with burger shot written under there so that is pretty cool our last car of this is the Cheval Monster Truck. It's kind of got this blue and white with a Scottish flag paint job and the huge epic wheels. That looks great. And our last three vehicles are going to be some of the new ones that are not cars. This one is the Kraken Submarine. You can get a kind of a good look of how maneuverable and agile this is going to be. Followed by the Dodo Seaplane. This one looks great as well. It's got a great color style as well as with the landing gear. You can definitely tell it's meant for water. And finally, the Zero Blimp, which of course is going to be a maneuverable and more faster blimp for you guys in Grand Theft Auto 5. So those are all some of the new vehicles returning in GTA 5. Again, I can't wait to get my hands on this in the next generation. And I know you guys are excited to get your hands on it as well, returning in Grand Theft Auto 5 on the PS4 and Xbox One. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Be sure... To so let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Be sure to let me know which one is your favorite vehicle. Also, be sure to leave a like on the video if you did enjoy. And subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new. Or you like daily Grand Theft Auto 5 videos like this. Without the way, guys, like I said, thanks for watching. Take care. And I'll see you guys in the next video.